hey guys welcome back to another vlog once again i'm going to another brunch i'm proud of myself i haven't flaked when i say i'm going i'll be there we'll see how long this lasts but i'm rushing right now as you can see i have the clip in my hair trying to keep it all together it's like 90 degrees outside i'm burning up i will try to get a full shot of my entire outfit once i'm there because i don't have time to do it right now because i'm in a rush but Hopefully I'll film once I get there. So with that being said, I will see you guys later. Peace. Guys, I have no idea how hot it is. It says 87 degrees in here, so I can only imagine. I'm sweating like a pig. Oh, God, Jesus Christ. God, ma. All right, let me get the get in. I think this thing is gonna take me on the parkway. I can't drive because last time I tried driving and vlogging, the camera kept falling all over the place. So, again, like I said before, I will see you guys when I get there. Let's see, parkway south. I parked, right here. me too. Right there. Oh, I parked perfect. over there. Guys, we'll meet you at the next spot, okay? Yeah. <laughs> okay, I am in Montclair at the next spot. So we're at this spot called Alto. I don't know if it's a rooftop. But we'll see. I'm parking the parking lot because I'm not beat to be looking for parking. I think I'm going to cut the camera off until I get to the spot. i got to see where everyone else is. All right. Bye, guys. yesterday into last night it was extremely hot it was like 90 degrees i was sweating bullets okay sweating bullets so we went to this one burn spot called moonshine in millburn mill burn new jersey it was cute i was sweating like crazy sweated all my hair out then we went to another spot in montclair i'm, I'm not sure if i'm gonna like name them in the vlog if I do, I'll, I'll tag them once I'm there when I show that that scene. Anyway, so we're like, okay, let's go to the other spot, rooftop spot in Montclair. And we accidentally made the reservation for two people instead of three because it was three of us there. And they would not accommodate it at all. Like, they were being so strict. Like, I get it's the times and everything that's going on, recreation 19 or whatever. 
but they definitely lifted the restrictions a little bit in New Jersey. Like I know it's not every, I believe everything's at full capacity. If not, they've increased the capacity, but they were not accommodated at all. Like one extra person. So eventually they accommodated us eventually, but I just didn't like how they handled it. It was just really annoying. I'm like, we're all about this big. Like how much space you think we're going to take up? And then we get up there and there's like so many empty spots and I get it. People make reservations. They have to have it open and free in case they do show up. But it was just a little annoying, but it was real cute or whatever. So, but yeah, that was my Sunday and let me see what time it is. All right, I gotta get out of here. It is 8.03 and I gotta be to work. I'm gonna tell you what's not gonna be work, but I'll get there. So, I will catch up with you guys later. Bye. Hi guys, I'm back again. I'm not sure how many days have transpired between the last clip and now, but the week went from 90 degrees down to like 50, 40 degrees. And that whole week I was looking a hot mess. I just didn't have time to record. I've been at work looking crazy. Not that crazy, but you know. But now today is Memorial Weekend, so a few days have transpired. So... Yeah, and it's freezing, but today is finally the sun came out, so I decided why not record? Finally, not a gloomy day. So anyway, how does my makeup look? I've been going with pretty much the same look that I've always been going with, but just even less, I'm trying to get my skin together. I don't know how many of you guys have watched that Lori Harvey Vogue segment when she was doing her makeup. So I just did a few things just to keep it light. I added some blush. I didn't, have, ugh, I didn't bring the palette. Let me grab the palette real quick. Did a, like a blush look. Like we gave like a flushed look on her face. And I looked at my makeup side. I threw everything away. But what I had left, I didn't know I had something similar. This Anastasia Beverly Hills blush palette. And I decided to use the color in the middle. I'm not sure she still has these. This palette, this trio is called Very Adore. I use Exotic and Desert. And I sort of tap in, mix it together, and just put it on apples and just a little bit on my nose. Did my eyebrows. And my usual, this is my go-to foundation, even when I try everything else, when I just want like a real natural, everyday, rock to throw look. The Lancome, the Tint Idol Ultra Wear. And it also has SPF in it too, as well. And I also put my SPF on Plus, I use the Bobbi Brown Vitamin Rich Face Base. And my color in Lancome is 460 Suede W. I don't know if it'll focus, but that's the color that I wear. And on my lips, my regular lip combo that I use, and then my favorite Fenty lip gloss in Fenty Glow. I found the one that I lost, and I lost it again. And this is the one that I bought, the new one I bought from the VIP sale. And then I set with this Anastasia Beverly Hills Dewy Set Setting Spray. She used this also in her um, her segment on Vogue too, and I love it. It gives that really glowy look. And then this that I bought on the VIB sale, the Tom Ford Soleil Blanc Shimmer and Body Oil. I love it. I don't know if you guys can see it from here. But I already based it down with cocoa butter, because that's what I use every day. You know, we gotta look nice and healthy and glowy. But I put this on top, and it does really smell like the beach, but now that I'm smelling it, it's more a coconutty slash vanilla. And I put a little bit over my arms and my chest. And yeah. So also I want to show you guys, I bought some new sunglasses. They're from Elisa Johnson or Elisa Johnson. You know, um, Magic Johnson's daughter. I don't know if you can see because it's so white. But that's how the box looks. So I, she came out with a sunglasses line. And when it launched, I ordered a pair. So it comes in a box like I showed you, and then it also comes in this white case. I'm thinking I should probably maybe do like a little unboxing on Insta Stories. How I do when I post on Insta Stories, I'll post it once everything goes away. I won't show it for like another week. Maybe I should do something like on Insta Stories, like unboxing, like a reel or something. But anyway, it comes in this white case, and it has her name on it as well. I don't know if you can see from this angle. What the fuck? Ooh. Another side of the window. Anyway, it's all white, so it's going to be washed out with my white balls. And then, 
It comes with a cleaning cloth. It has her logo on it. Let's see. And then it looks like it's probably care instructions or an authenticity card in here. And these are the sunnies. So they're like a tortoise frame and then the lens is like a bluish purple and on the temples it also has her logo i don't know if you can see it says like the little eagle on the side and it also has it on the side as well and what is the style that i have i don't even know i'll put it in the description box what style i have i cannot remember what style i, I purchased but again i do have like tortoise shell like this natural color but i don't have anything with the frame like this and aviator is my shape as well so i figured let me try and then support i thought these were so dope let me see if this thing will focus there it is i thought these were so dope like with what i have on an all black outfit or if i wanted to wear something more with the tone that's in the lens it could work all white i thought these were super dope so if you have more of like a wider face these will definitely work I love them. What do you think? But yeah, I'm gonna wear these today. Cute and casual. And I have so many like little duster bags I probably put in my purse with. These, the cases are a little too chunky for me. But yeah, I love them. So yeah, I may just, for the rest of the day, I'm not sure what I'm going to do. I kind of want some ice cream, but first I'm going to try to take some content for Insta Stories, Instagram. I always bring my mirror from my hallway into my living room and take that same setting, basically showing the outfit of the day, whether it's casual, loungewear, or it's an actual full outfit. I like to take my pictures, and then, I don't know, I'll see what the day takes me, but I just want to pop in here since I haven't seen you guys in a minute. And I will talk to you guys later. And to, uh, where are we, Chels? No, no, the place. Viva Margarita in Wellington. So hopefully we can get some drinky drinks. I'm blocking on my phone because I forgot my blocking phone. Hopefully we can get it because they closed them. Just one drinky drink. Hey guys, I'm back. Quick run to Starbucks. I don't know why they've been. Every time I go to a Starbucks, they run out of the oat milk, and like it makes such a big difference. I got a dirty chai, and I had to get soy milk. I don't like almond milk. It just has this weird nutty taste. But the oat milk makes it creamy. That's what I like. But they just keep running out of it. And it's so annoying. I went to get drinks last night at this Mexican spot and I finally was able to try those Barreria tacos. It tastes disgusting. I'm like, what the heck? Like that comfort sauce or gravy that you supposed to dip it in, it was like brothy. It was just weird. But my pina colada was good, so I guess that was really the point of me going. But I was just really disappointed. I'm not sure if it was how they made it or it's just nasty <laughs> altogether. But... Yeah, I wasn't impressed. But I took a day off from work. I already had a PTO day scheduled after the weekend. So I'm happy I'm able to just get a day. And normally it'll be peaceful and quiet. But like, it's just so many people out here. I'm like, what the heck is going on? I have a Zara return I need to do. And every time I go, the line is from the register all the way to the door. And I don't have time to be sitting there waiting 30, 40 minutes on a line. I just want to make a simple return. That's all I want to do. I walked into the mall and I could see from the outside that the line went to the door. So I politely took me in that big old box in my hand and walked right out. Mm -mm. I got to figure out a way to mail it back. I cannot be standing up in those lines. For one, every you can't try anything on in the store. So you're really going to be returning if something doesn't fit. 
which I've been doing, or you'll get it when you shop online, and the quality sucks. It's like stringy, stringy, hanging from every which way. I'm like, what the hell? No, so I got to figure out a way to get this return. The only time I have is after work, and the line is always long. It's freaking 1 o'clock on a Tuesday. Why is it so many people? Mm. Hello? Yeah. I thought I would just make a quick return, but no, the line's still long. It's full of people, so. Uh, <sighs> dude, I forgot early. Like, stop in the morning, get up early. I'm gonna let you not work. Yeah, but even then, when I went before, um... Hello? When I went, if you go early, if you get up early and go to the mall open, mm -hmm. you know no problem. Yeah. Because when we go home, the pub, me leave from work and go there, not a soul not in there. Yeah. If we go shop right early, me come from the body not in there. You have to know when to go to them places. Right. But yeah, I'm gonna just finish eating my breakfast. Well, really lunch, but breakfast for me. And then I'm gonna go to my mom's and then I'll figure it out. I may just end this vlog here. I don't know. I don't do much with my day, and especially my day off. I don't really want to do much. But yeah, I don't do much. I don't have anything exciting planned for the rest of the day besides the supermarket. So I may just end this vlog here and I will see you guys in the next one. Don't forget, like I always say, comment, like, hit the subscription bell, the notification bell, and I will see you guys later. Bye.